Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is to cook the pasta, which you see in here, I have a pot with boiling water, and I'm using mustachioli pasta, that's 16 ounces or one pound, and depending on how much you're gonna make, we just, oh, you can use the pasta of your preference, don't have to be this one. So we're not gonna add no salt, and we're not gonna add no oil. We're just gonna let the, the as you see, the water has to be boiling, and then we're gonna add the pasta. We're gonna cook this for eight to 10 minutes or until the pasta is done. So you put it in there and you're gonna cook this on cover, on cover for approximately 10 minutes. Now we're gonna wait for the pasta to cook. I'm gonna show you what the uh, vegetables I'm gonna use for this pasta. This is all my vegetables. If you don't have some of the vegetables, don't worry about it. Or you can add the vegetables you like because you are the one who's gonna eat this. So you can add more or you can take some of the vegetables if you don't like them. I'm gonna start with one onion. I got it in slices, as you see. Yellow pepper, that's like a probably half cup. Green peppers. Uh, this is eggplant and this is optional. I have this left over, so I'm gonna use it. I have some mushrooms, approximately one cup. Uh, one zucchini. And the amount depends on how much you like. Some baby carrots, or you can eat just the regular cut it, carrots and cut it in slices. Some broccoli and some cauliflower. And I also have a package of spinach, which is going back, as you see. So I'm gonna go ahead and use it because I'm gonna cook this spinach. So um, I don't wanna throw that away, so I'm gonna go ahead and cook it. Okay, in here I have a big pan. We call this a caldero, and I put a little bit water. And I'm just gonna go ahead and cook the hard vegetables first, which is carrot, broccoli, and cauliflower. I'm gonna cook this and depend on how how you like your vegetables. That's what you're gonna that's what you're gonna cook them the time. Some people like it soft, some like some people like the vegetables crunchy. So I'm gonna cover it and I'm gonna let it steam. And I like my vegetables to be soft. But if you don't like that, you let it leave this less time. And in here I have a saucepan, which I'm going to saute the other vegetables. I'm gonna put a little bit of olive oil, or any kind of oil you like. And I'm gonna add the rest of the, the like green peppers and onions first. Now I'm gonna add the vegetables. And we're gonna cook this and move the vegetables constantly. The pasta is done, I'm just gonna drain the water. I'm just gonna take that, these vegetables. And I wanna mention, you can do this in only one pot. You don't have to do what I'm doing in here. I'm doing this because my daughter is very picky. And, but you can just use the big pot and then saute the vegetable first and then add the other fresh, the other half vegetable after. And you don't have to use too many pots. Now I'm gonna add a little bit more oil and then I'm gonna saute the rest of the vegetables. The mushrooms zucchini and the eggplant. And then this is gonna take a few minutes. I'm gonna add some salt. My, my vegetables are done. Now we're gonna blend the three garlic with a cup of oil. In here, I put one cup of oil. I put three fresh garlic and a handful of cilantro. 
and then we're gonna blend it. Now I'm gonna add the rest of the vegetable with the first vegetable we cook. And I'm just gonna cook, I'm gonna put the whole thing of the spinach. Now I'm gonna add the onions and peppers. chicken breast, skinless and boneless, which I'm going to cut it in pieces because I'm going to add chicken. If you have leftover chicken, a baked chicken or any leftover chicken, any leftover meat, you can add that in there. So I just got to show you real quick. I'm just going to sprinkle some salt and pepper and I'm going to cook this with a little bit of butter or you can use a little bit of oil and add it to your pasta. So I just gotta go ahead and cook the chicken. This is optional. I'm gonna sprinkle some of the Parmesan cheese. And at this time, you're gonna adjust the salt and pepper to your pasta. The chicken is done. I also want to add the chicken in there and like I said, if you have a cooked chicken already and a leftover cooked chicken, you can add that in there. <music> Behind camera I put some salt and pepper and ready to serve. Ariani, ¿qué tú vas a comer, mami? Pasta. ¿Pasta con qué? Um, carrots. Ajá. Uh -huh. And broccoli. And more carrot. Ok, pues come todo lo que por ahí va la pasta. Está bueno. Thumbs up. Mm -hmm. Y ahora que te vas a comer. La zanahoria. Ya. Yeah. Está rico. Mm -hmm.